we are going to start the 10th science rule. The topic is first is heredity and evolution. Now the topic is related to the genetics. We know what is the meaning of genetics? That is, it is a branch of science which deals to the study of genes and heredity. It is a genes and heredity study. Before going to discuss about the genes or before going to discuss about the topic in detail, first we know what is the meaning of the genes. As we know, the cell is a basic unit of the life and if we observe the structure of the cell, that is, the cell it contains nucleus. In the nucleus, which contains a thread-like structure, we call it as a chromosome. As well as there is a presence of nuclear, some other, other cell organelles are also present. But here, first we are going to discuss only about the DNA. That is the DNA which is present in the chromosome, which is present in the nucleus. And uh, what is the meaning of DNA? In detail, we have already discussed the mind standard. That is DNA means it is a deoxyribonucleic acid. It is a double standard structure. It is a double standard structure, but it is a coil. So it is called as double helix. It is made up of many nucleotides. Now, what is the meaning of nucleotides? Nucleotides, that is, it contains deoxyribose sugar, phosphoric acid, and nitrogen bases. We know what is the meaning of a nitrogen bases. That is, nitrogen bases are adenine, guanine, cytosine, thiamine. Out of these, adenine and guanine are called as purines. These are a chemical structure, uh, is a purine. And cytosine and thiamine are pyrimidines. So, if there is formation of complementary bases takes place in the DNA, that is, regularly A is compared with the P, that is, adenine, adenine is paired with the thiamine, cytosine is paired with the guanine. That is, the bonding between this adenine and thiamine is double bonding, and cytosine and guanine is a triple bond. So that in such a these pairing are called as complementary pairs. You know, complementary pairs are some other that. Means in any pairing, for example, A P C G. Asha padhal in a pairing they call this one. Now, what is the meaning of the gene? Now, what is the meaning of the gene? That is a sequence of DNA is called as genes. So. This is a double standard molecule in which the pairing is such a that A, P, C, G. We have double bond. This one is a triple bond. Yancha is a triple bond. Ata, yancha is a half of segment as yancha is a half of segment as yancha is a half of segment as yancha is So the segments of this DNA is called as G. Jeva is a half of segment as yancha is a half of segment if you have a name, you can see the stove. 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 So, what it indicates? Yes, we are generally observing the similarities between the parents and offspring. We are observing the similarities. In the similarities, that is, from this we can say that what is the meaning of a gene? That is, it transmits the characters from parents to offspring. That is from by generation to next generation. This is called as hereditary characters. So what is the function of gene? The function of a gene is that the transmission of hereditary characters from parents to offspring. offspring. That is from by generation to next generation. From this, it is clear that the gene is a functional unit of heredity. So, what is the meaning of heredity? So, heredity is the process of transmission of the hereditary characters from one generation to next generation, that is from parents to offspring. The study of the genes was first started by Johann Gregor Mendel and the era was 1886. He was a pioneer of modern genetics and also called as the father of genetics. In 1901, the Hugo de Veris, he studied the reasons behind the sudden change due to mutation.
mutational chromosome. Now the question arises, what is the meaning of the mutation? So what is the meaning of a mutation? Suppose this one is a chromosome which contains a pairing as A, P, C, G. Asha patta di na normal pairing hai. A is a combination T share, C is a combination G share. Asha patta di na hi normal pairing hai. Suppose instead of A, T, atla hai zet T hai, hai missing hai. Suppose it is totally missed or the, ya cha pairing hai totally sukle like C, Q, R, G. Conditions don't. Okay? One is totally missing. A is a complementary pair. It is not a complementary pair. It is not a complementary pair. Means it is not a normal gene. Asher where it has a gene. It is not a normal gene. And it is so that it is called as mutational chromosome. So that the chromosome is also not normal. It is called as mutational chromosome. And which is responsible for the different different disorders or the different uh, problems create ho shakta. such as it is responsible for the formation uh, for the sickle cell anemia or different types of cancer this is, these are responsible due to the mutational chromosome on the other hand in 1902 that is Walter and Sutton, Sutton, Walter and Sutton they first observed the pairing of a uh, chromosome so, they uh, have grasshopper, grasshopper madhe hai observation In 1904, that is Oswald Avery, Oswald Avery, McLean McCarthy, Colin McLean. Yes, scientists they calculate, uh, they observe that DNA, DNA is a, DNA is a genetic material in all living organisms except virus. Fuck the virus madhe hai genetic material nahi. Virus shiva serva living organisms madhe DNA behaves as a genetic material. Now we know what is the meaning of genetic material that is transmission of a traits or transmission of characters from one generation to next generation. These are carried by DNA so that the genetic material is present in all living organisms except virus. Here Pahilanda proof that the scientists ni ke Next, in 1961, Frankos Jacob and Jack Monod, they proved the, they gave the, a model of protein synthesis. Protein synthesis is a model that he proposed ke le hai. And what is the role of this? How is the model proposed ke le benefit ka hai? What is the advantage of this, proposing this model? That is to identify the genetic codes in DNA. Here is the genetic codes. Here is genetic codes identify hona cha trushti na. Yeah, models are so, uh, models are role to mahatwa sa ahe. As well as, in, it also plays important role in the technique of recombinant DNA technology. Now, uh, what is the meaning of recombinant DNA technology? Recombinant DNA technology and keep hey, identifying genetic codes in DNA both plays important role in genetic engineering. Genetic engineering but has a role mahatwa jai. Recombinant DNA technology sa apne routine life mein kasha patta di na role ahe. Kis asa as, for example, routine life mein example samte apne regular ghara ghara mein te as diabetes hai. Diabetes asa tar apan kai kurta bahiru ni insulin ghe tas to. Hey, insulin kasa tayar hota so it is prepared by the recombinant DNA technology. Recombinant DNA technology just sahaya na lab madhe hai insulin tayar kala zata. As well as we know different vaccines are also prepared. Vek vek aya prakat cha nasi tayar kala zata. For example, um, about the rabies chia se, ki unwa hepatitis chia se, hai sabya cha vaccines tayar kala zata. Ya sabya recombinant DNA technology just sahaya na tayar kala zata sta. Now, next part is the transcription, transmission, and transmutation. First, we'll discuss the transcription. Now, what is the transcription? That is the information which is stored in the DNA is passed to the RNA. That is the formation of the RNA from DNA. The process is called as transcription. Now, in this process, the process is actually the information which is stored in the DNA is transfer or it is passed to the RNA. RNA is responsible for the protein synthesis which is whole theme of our life so that it is called as a central dogma. It is a central dogma. Now, 
first part, uh, first important thing here about the structure of PNA. We know the structure of PNA is a double standard. It is a coiled structure, means it is a hollow, it is a helix. Now, if we observe the structure of DNA, it is a double standard and coil. Now, the combinations to share A is combined to T, C is combined to G, Asha Paddhati no combinations here, Aplala Bakaramata. Coiled structure, here, Pulla Panyasha Paddhati no A, T, C, G, here, connected. A is a connection T, here, C, R, T is a connection A, Asha Paddhati no here, pairing of the, it is called as a complementary pair, see, already added. Other hip coil structure in the process of transcription, first step of the car, first step of the winding, there is an unwinding text place. Means here the RNA polymerase, RNA polymerase plays important role. RNA polymerase. It is a it is an enzyme which plays important role. If we have the unwind so out of these, H is two strands. Hai. There are two strands. Madla, ita kaya hai A, a centre ita T hai, ita C a centre ita G hai, and so on. Asha padha thi na nehbe pramana hai structure. Ya pe ki kya two strands pe ki only single strand is used. Kya two pe ki fakt aeka strands ja wapar hai. Jab madhe transcription ja process madhe kela zato. So I am repeating the diagram. That is only one strand. Is now this is A, T, C, G. So these are the subnucleotides on this. Has so one strand there. Ha, DNA was there. Ata ha kya kar rahe? Ha, DNA is a strand. Now here it forms a complementary. It forms a complementary pair of RNA. Complementary pair. Pair karta na. Ata RNA pair hona hai. Ata sabhi pehle to basically we must know what is the difference between the DNA and RNA. DNA jo aapke bade je mitochondrial spaces hai, he contain. So it contains adenine, guanine, cytosine, thymine. On the other hand, RNA jo aapke bade kya hai? RNA madhe apn same mitochondrial spaces hai. Fakta kya hai? Adenine, guanine, cytosine. Instead of thymine, there is a presence of uracil. That is why uracil is here. But the DNA person, if you have a RNA pair, it has a RNA, particularly it is called as mRNA, that is messenger RNA. So, messenger RNA pair is here. As a nucleotide, J nitrogenous base is here. That's a complementary base pair. So, A, instead of thymine, it has thymine. So, instead of thymine, there is a presence of uracil. It has thymine, it forms adenine. It has cytosine, it has guanine. It has guanine, it forms a cytosine. So, here, that is, in the, in the, this process we call it as a transcription. Transcription मदे का ये DNA जा मदे जो, जो message जा है, the message which is present in the DNA, it is, it is passed to the RNA. हा, RNA वर्थी pass message pass जाले ला है, that's a complementary base pair तैर जाले ला है, फक्त फरक का ये, instead of thiamine, there is a presence of uracil. Now this process takes place in the nucleus. ही जी process है, transcription जी in transcription G process in nucleus madhe taya kutu. So, asha paddhati na hi process ahe. So, we have already discussed about the process of transcription. We know the process of transcription takes place in the nucleus. Here the mRNA synthesis takes place in which contains thousands of triplet codon. We have already discussed all of these things. Now the question arises: what is the meaning of a triplet codon? Triplet codon, that is, uh, it is a set of three nucleotides. It is a set of three nucleotides which are present on the mRNA. So here, which is formed, the message which is formed uh, on the mRNA from the DNA. So here, the set of these three codons, three nucleotides, we call it as a triplet codon. Now, the message, here the message is from the DNA. Her mRNA, now this which is formed in the nucleus, now it comes to the cytoplasm. So, nucleus mother tayar zhanela hai, 
सेल आहे या सुपिनी या या न्यूक्लियस मध्ये काय झालेलं आहे डीएनए मधून हा आरएनए सिंथेसिस झालेला आहे नाव दिस आरएनए कम्स इन द सायटोप्लाझम आता हा सायटोप्लाझम मध्ये येतो नाव दिस एज इज दिस एमआरएनए कम्स इन सायटोप्लाझम हियर इट फॉर्म्स नाउ हियर द फर्स्ट सेकंड स्टेप या ठिकाणी आहे दैट इज द प्रोसेस वी कॉल्ड इट एज अ ट्रान्सलेशन सेकंड स्टेप इज द ट्रान्सलेशन ह्या ट्रान्सलेशन मध्ये काय होतंय जो मेसेज एमआरएनए वरती आहे हा एमआरएनए कडचा मेसेज हा टीआरएनए कडे टीआरएनए सिंथेसिस होतो टीआरएनए फॉर्मेशन कशा पद्धतीने होतं अगेन देर इज अ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ कॉम्प्लिमेंटरी बेस पेअर वी नो ऑलरेडी व्हॉट इज द मिनिंग ऑफ कॉम्प्लिमेंटरी बेस पेअर आहे कि ए सो कॉम्बिनेशन टी शी आता टी नाहीच आहे आपल्याकडे आर एन ए मध्ये सो दॅट इन्स्टेड ऑफ थाय मीन दॅट इज अरासिल आहे सो दॅट ए आहे तर कॉम्बाईन कॉम्बिनेशन फॉर्म्स युरासिल जिथं युरासिल आहे कॉम्बिनेशन फॉर्म्स ऍड इन सॅटोसिन ग्वानिन आणि ग्वानिन आहे तिथं सॅटोसिन अशा पद्धतीनं जो कोड आहे जो मेसेज आहे तो मेसेज या ठिकाणी टी आर एन ए वरती येतो नाव अगेन द सेट ऑफ थ्री न्यूक्लिओटाईड्स जिथे इट इज कॉल्ड ऍज अँटीकोडॉन कि ज्या टी आर एन ए वरती जो सेट आहे थ्री न्यूक्लिओटाईड्स चा इट इज कॉल्ड ऍज अँटीकोडॉन आणि जो एम आर एन ए वरचा थ्री न्यूक्लिओटाईड्स चा सेट आहे इट इज कॉल्ड ऍज ट्रिपले कोडॉन we have already discussed about the transcription translation and now we are going to discuss about the translocation but the translocation ma just study karta na we uh, we know that is a mrna synthesis takes place in the process of transcription second step that is a formation of the trna the process we call it as a translation now in third step that is in translocation what happens ya thikani so codon hai that is a three set of a nucleotides here the process of complementary base pair formation takes place to form the uh, to form the trna that is anticodon anticodon tayar zalele trna ahe ata ha trna kay karto that is we know this is uh, the anticodon which is present on the trna it is a specific codon for a specific amino acid so that this amino acid which is identified by this trna now that particular amino acid it is identified from the cytoplasm he said by process kuto hoti hai it takes place in the cell cell mathe ya sagla goshti hota hai nucleus cha outside ribosome namachi ji cell organelle ahe tacha mane ya sagla goshti hota hai and so that now this हा जो टी आर एन ए आहे हा सायटोप्लाझम आउट साइड हे सगळं सायटोप्लाझम आहे या सायटोप्लाझम मध्ये स्पेसिफिक वी डो दॅट ट्वेंटी डिफरंट अमिनो ऍसिड आर प्रेझेंट सो द स्पेसिफिक अमिनो ऍसिड इट इज आयडेंटिफाईड बाय द टी आर एन ए इट इज कॅच इट इज कलेक्टेड अँड हिअर इट कम्स दिस स्पेसिफिक अमिनो ऍसिड इट कम्स हिअर इन दायबोसो अँड दिस रायबोसो इट इज मूव टू द नेक्स्ट सेन्स नेक्स्ट स्टेप हिअर आणि त्याच वेळी काय आहे हा जो टी टी आर एन ए जो आहे हा या साईडला लिपून जातो ऑन द अदर हँड द सेम प्रोसेस टेक्स प्लेस म्हणजेच काय आहे याच्यासाठी स्पेसिफिक अँटीकोडॉन्स तयार होतात त्या अँटीकोडॉन्सच्या अनुषंगानं जे अमिनो ऍसिड आहे त्या अमिनो ऍसिड कॅच केलं जातं ते या ठिकाणी आणून ठेवलं जातं तो जो टी आर एन ए आहे तो टी आर एन ए निघून जातो पुन्हा हा रायबोसो पुढं पुढं सरकतो आणि अशा पद्धतीनं टी आर एट फॉर्म्स द चेन ऑफ chain of the amino acid which is called as polypeptide chain and afterwards which is responsible for the formation of the protein that is the process of protein synthesis takes place in the ribosome so this is a complete step of a protein synthesis that is transcription translation and translocation asha paddhati na protein synthesis he tya thikani hot asta now next step is what is the meaning of mutation mutation that is sudden changes takes place in the nucleotides for example this is a main sequence which is apekshit aplala jo sequence hai suppose this one is a main sequence but there are some changes takes place in the nucleotides that is instead of thymine there is a presence of g uh, presence of guanine 
instead of guanine there is a presence of in such a way there is a change in the nucleotide takes place which is responsible for the mutation a short step now we call it as a mutation that is it is also called as a jumping of genes which is responsible for the certain genetic disorders such as sickle cell anemia or different types of cancer he aplyala tashamata examples bagharam Now next we will discuss about the evolution. Now evolution that is a gradual change, gradual change, very slow changes takes place, and so that there is a long duration. The required kalavati uh, ani that is a long duration takes place. As it is a slow process for the development of the living organism, the development of living organism takes place in the process is very slow, and so that there is a change in specific characters takes place. But take प्रत्येक जी कैरेक्टर्स है या कैरेक्टर्स मे अपना चेंजेस बढ़ा स्टेप वाइज चेंजेस नाउ द सेवरल जनरेशन दट इज थाउजंड्स ऑफ जनरेशन शुड बी पास वी हैव टू पास थाउजंड्स ऑफ जनरेशन एंड सो दैट इट फॉर्म्स अ न्यू स्पेसिज अशा पद्धति न्यू स्पेसिज फॉर्म होते एंड द प्रोसेस इज फॉर एज इवोल्यूशन इन विच वेरी स्मॉल और वेरी स्लो प्रोसेस एक्सप्रेस वेरी लॉन्ग इरा इज रिक्वायर्ड हियर ऐट द बिगिनिंग सुरुवती दैट इज नियर अबाउट थ्री पॉइंट थ्री पॉइंट फाइव बिलियन इयर्स बैक वी हैव टू गो सुरुवती सीम्पल टाइप ऑफ लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम स्वेर फॉर्म सिंपल ऑर्गेनिजम स्वेर है विच वेर मेड अप ऑफ ऑर्गेनिक एंड इन ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड सगत सुरुआत सीम्पल टाइप है ऑर्गेनिक इन ऑर्गेनिक इट फॉर्म्स अ कॉम्प्लेक्स वन कॉम्प्लेक्स प्रोटीन कि न्यूक्लिक एसिड है अशा पद्धति कॉम्प्लेक्स प्रकार के लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम से तैयार है Organisms which were formed at the beginning, these were of the primitive type. Pratamik avastek mathe development ji condition ko kame hoti, so that is uh, the and uh, they form afterwards it forms the they form the plants and the animals are formed. The tremendous diversity was observed on the earth. That is uh, the diversity about the shape, complexity, khub way with the apple ka the chamade pranen chani manas pati in chamade baghala mehta. कशा पद्धतिन दैट इज एनिमल्स एट द बिगिनिंग दे फॉर्म अ युनिसेल्युलर टू मल्टी सेल्युलर एट द बिगिनिंग दे फॉर्म अ सिंपल युनिसेल्युलर लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम सच एस अमेबा अमेबा पास अमेबा हा सिंपल पद्धति कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी वाड़ के लिए इट फॉर्म्स द मल्टी सेल्युलर वेल अशा मल्टी सेल्युलर द एक्जाम्पल इज द वेल दैट इज प्रवास कैसा युनिसेल्युलर टू मल्टी सेल्युलर सिंपल टू कॉम्प्लेक्स अशा पद्धति एनिमल्स तैयार है तसच प्लांट्स के बाबी में सुधा युनिसेल सेल्युलर मल्टी सेल्युलर द एक्झाम्पल्स आर युनिसेल्युलर प्लांट्स सच एज अ क्लोरेला टू द मल्टी सेल्युलर प्लांट्स सच एज अ बनियन ट्री इन व्हिच द प्रवास कसा आहे युनिसेल्युलर टू मल्टी सेल्युलर सिंपलिसिटी टू कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी अशा पद्धतीने आपल्याला सगळ्या गोष्टी ह्या बघायला मिळतात व्हेन द लाइफ इज प्रेजेंट ऑन एव्हरीथिंग ऑन द अर्थ दैट इट इज प्रेजेंट इन एयर इट इज प्रेजेंट इन वॉटर as well as it is also present in the air so that the we know but the human is very intellectual human jo hai ha khub intellectual hai so that apan kay kele re vek vega theories sa abhyas kele re tar a different theories were studied some theories ke uh, chote some theories were based on the religious god based that ki god has created all of these things वगैरे अशा ज्या सुद्धा थेरीज आहेत दीज आर बेस्ट त्याचा काय दॅट इज गॉड हॅज क्रिएटेड ऑल लिव्हिंग ऑर्गेनिझम दीज आर कॉल्ड एज अ रिलिजियस थेरी परंतु सायन्स जे आहे सायन्स हे रिलिजियस थेरीवरती कधी बेस करत नाही आपण सायन्स काय म्हणतो शेवटी प्रत्येक गोष्टीचे एव्हिडन्स मागितले जातात त्याच्यामध्ये पुरावे हे अपेक्षित आहेत पुरावे महत्वाचे आहेत त्यामुळं रिलिजियस थेरी ही त्याच्यामध्ये काय इट वॉज नॉट ऍक्सेप्टेड अँड सो दॅट की आपण काय म्हणतो सायन्स म्हणतं की आम्हाला एव्हिडन्स द्या आणि त्या एव्हिडन्सच्या बेसिस वरती सब थेरीज वेल स्टडी आणि याच्यामध्ये कोणत्या गोष्टी ह्या प्रेफर केल्या जातात की ऑल लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम आर डेव्हलप ऑल दर इज अ डेव्हलपमेंट ऑफ ऑल लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम टेक्स प्लेस दर आर सर्टन चेंजेस टेक्स प्लेस अँड दीज चेंजेस आर फॉर्म फ्रॉम अ 
ऑर्गॅनिझम फ्रॉम अ सिंगल ऑर्गॅनिझम एका ऑर्गॅनिझम पासून सगळ्या ऑर्गॅनिझमची डेव्हलपमेंट झालेली आहे अँड सो दॅट तीज आर कॉल्ड आणि हाच बेस जो आहे तो बेस बेस हा या इमोल्युशनचा आहे की जो बेसिकली ग्रॅज्युअल डेव्हलपमेंट ऑफ ऑर्गॅनिझम टेक्स प्लेस दिस फेरी वॉज ऍक्सेप्टेड म्हणजे अशा पद्धतीनं जी इव्हॉल्युशनची फेरी आपण कशा पद्धतीनं हा डेव्हलपमेंट झालेली आहे त्याचे एव्हिडन्सेस कोणते आहेत सो फर्स्ट वेल डिस्कस द मॉर्फोलॉजिकल एव्हिडन्स वॉट इज द मेनिंग ऑफ मॉर्फोलॉजिकल एव्हिडन्स दॅट इज स्टडी ऑफ एक्सटर्नल स्ट्रक्चर वॉट इज द मेनिंग ऑफ एक्सटर्नल स्ट्रक्चर बाह्य रूप कोणत्याही लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझमच्या बाह्य रूपाचा अभ्यास करणे that is the morphological evidence that is external structure so first the structure of the plants were studied that is the different plants were discussed if you observe the all of the plants the structure is the same means all generally all plants have a root stem leaves that is the structure is the same on the other hand from this it is clear that there are similarities are present in all of the plants now it is an example about the plants the same about the evidence is given about the animals now what is evidence is given that is generally all of the animals it walks on the feet as well as the structure of the mouth structure of the nostrils structure of the uh, structure of the uh, position of the eyes structure of the eyes as well as the hair on the body all of these are the similar so that all of the similarities are observed means indicates that origin is the same origin is is the same as well as means indicates that they have the common ancestor now next we discuss about the anatomical evidence so what is the meaning of anatomical evidence that is to study the internal structure of the living organism so the different organisms are taken here and the internal structure are studied now first one one is the human hand if you observe the human hand we know what is the function of the human hand that is the skillful work skillful work is the important function on the other hand the cat's four leg manjaranse pai what is the function that is for the walking purpose now next is the well flipper the devmasa hai ya devmasa se par ya so function ka hai that is for the swimming purpose next is the bats potassium that is the wings of the bat means uh, what was the what was the to wings that's a function ka hai that is for the flying purpose now we know the functions of the organs the different organs are the different but if we observe the uh, if we study the internal structure of all of these things all of these living organism the internal structure is the similar that is the structure of the bones and the bony joints are similar that is the similarities are observed the different organs are taken of the different living organism different animals have pani parantu kaya tacha the internal structure the similarities are functions different are parantu internal structure is the same indicates that they have a common ancestor tancha purvaj ekach ahe eka purvajancha madhe development jhalele ahe ani asha prakarse vek vek living organisms tayar jhalele vestigial next is a vestigial organs what is the meaning of vestigial organs that is these are undeveloped or useless organs of the organism in certain organs but these are not totally useless in other organisms kahincha madhe he useless ahe but sarvancha madhe useless ahe asa nahi hai to kahincha madhe these are also useful so these are called as vestigial organs so what is the meaning of vestigial organs that is these are undeveloped or useful or useless organs in the organisms so we know that a sudden development of the tissues or the organs it doesn't test such a condition doesn't take place or such condition hot nahi ki achanak kai changes hota uh as a kai hot nas so that there are the gradual changes we know gradual changes that is step wise changes very slow development ki or degeneration whatever it takes place in very step wise very slow manner takes place so that uh, in such a way that is this uh, useless or the harmful living or uh, harmful 
जे चेंजेस आहेत इट इट स्टार्ट्स जनरेटिंग अँड डीजनरेटिंग अँड इट टेक्स प्लस थाउजंड्स ऑफ द इयर्स ही जी प्रोसेस आहे इट टेक्स प्लस इन द थाउजंड्स ऑफ द इयर्स अँड सो दॅट आफ्टरवर्ड्स द नॉन फंक्शनल सर्टन ऑर्गॅनिझम्स आर टोटली बिकम्स द नॉन फंक्शनल नाव वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दॅट इज दीज नॉन फंक्शनल ऑर्गन दीज नॉन फंक्शनल जे ऑर्गन्स आहेत दीज आर नॉन फंक्शनल इन सर्टन ऑर्गॅनिझम बट दीज आर फंक्शनल इन द अदर ऑर्गॅनिझम दीज आर इन सच अ कंडिशन दॅट लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम दीज आर नॉट वेस्टिजियल ऑर्गन फॉर एक्झाम्पल द अपेंडिक्स द अपेंडिक्स इज युजलेस फॉर द ह्युमन बेंग बट दीज आर इट प्लेज व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट रोल इन द रुमिनंट्स रुमिनंट्स रवंथ करणारे प्राणी आपल्या डायटमध्ये आपण जे अन्न ग्रहण करतोय ते सगळं काय प्रोसेस्ड फूड आपण घेत असतो सो दॅट दॅर इज नो रोल ऑफ द अपेंडिक्स परंतु जे रुमिनंट्स आहेत जे रवंथ करणारे प्राणी आहेत त्यांच्यामध्ये ते गवत गवत सारखं अन्न ग्रहण करत असतात त्यामुळे त्यांच्यामध्ये प्रोसेसिंग साठी सेल्युलॉस प्लेस व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट रोल अपेंडिक्स प्लेस व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट रोल सो दॅट इन दिस रुमिनंट्स देर इज नो वेस्ट अपेंडिक्स इज नॉट अ वेस्टिजियल ऑर्गन बट इन ह्युमन बिंग अपेंडिक्स इज अ वेस्टिजियल ऑर्गन द अदर वेस्टिजियल ऑर्गन्स आर ऑल्सो डिस्कस सच ऍज द मसल ऑफ द इयर पिना आपला जो एक्सटर्नल इयर आहे की जो मुगेबल असतो अदर लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम मध्ये परंतु दीज आर द लिमिटेशन ऑफ द ह्युमन बिंग दॅट इज वी कॅन नॉट मूव्ह अकॉर्डिंग टू द साऊंड बट द अदर लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम जे आहेत हे तर मूव्ह करू शकत असतात आपण तो मूव्ह करू शकत नाही इट इज अ युजलेस टू द मॅन परंतु इट प्लेज व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट रोल इन अदर लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम पर्टिक्युलरली इन मॅमल्स इन अदर मॅमल्स इट प्लेज व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट रोल सम अदर ऑर्गन्स आर डिस्कस सच ऍज अ टेर बोन इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड ऍज अ पॉकेट्स ऍज वेल ऍज अ विस्डम टेक दीज आर द सर्टन वेस्टिजियल ऑर्गन so next is the paleontological evidence so what is the meaning of paleontological evidence paleontological evidence means the land the land is dug and means the land is excavated and the study of the fossils takes place that is due to certain natural calamities such as a flood or earthquake that is uh, organisms are overburdened kahi naisukik apatti mulo gavacha gav gadli jata and so that the remnants and the impressions are preserved underground remnants of a shesh impressions that je thase je ahe he underground preserve kele jatat yacha sarkha zamini cha khali bhumikat ahe ase rahata and these are afterwards we call it as a fossil sena apan fossils asa mhanla jato so that there is a study of a fossils is important in the evolution jeva apan evolution cha abhyas karto tyacha madhe the study of no fossils plays very important role kasha paddhatino kela jato tyatla ek aplyala type sanglela hai that is routinely in animals and the plants the ratio of carbon 14 to carbon 12 it is constant suruvatila जोपर्यंत जोपर्यंत लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम हा लिव्हिंग आहे म्हणजे त्याची डेथ झालेली नाही तोपर्यंत दर इज अ कार्बन फोर्टीन द रेशो ऑफ कार्बन फोर्टीन टू कार्बन ट्वेल्व इज कॉन्स्टंट बट आफ्टर द डेथ ऑफ अ लिव्हिंग ऑर्गॅनिझम वॉट एव्हर इट मे बी द अॅनिमल ऑर प्लांट्स आफ्टर द डेथ नाव द डेथ नंतर साहजिकच काय द कन्झम्शन स्टॉप्स दॅट इज इनटेक ऑफ अ फूड मटेरियल इज स्टॉप so but, but as we know the carbon 14 is a radioactive so that as it is a radioactive naturally tacha mate tacha life hai tacha life half life asya mulo to change vala lagto on the other hand the carbon 12 is on non radioactive carbon 12 ha non radioactive ahe but here due to the carbon 14 is a radioactive that is a decaying of a carbon 14 takes place and so that now that is a ratio of carbon 14 to carbon 12 that is going on to change ha change wala shuruat hote now this process is called as it is a method now this method is called as carbon dating method yes a use kasha sathi hoto that it is it is used to determine the age of the fossils the fossils the age kar samasya sathi upyog hoto which is used in the paleontology and the anthropology so what is the meaning of paleontology and what is the meaning of anthropology 
परंटोलॉजी दैट इज द मराठी मध्य अपन अवशेष शास्त्र एंथ्रोपोलॉजी मानव वंश शास्त्र आता हे एक्झॅक्टली वॉट हॅपन काय केलेलं आहे दॅट इज अ लँड इज जग लँड जग केल्यानंतर काय आहे वी हॅव टू गोव्हन डाऊनवर्ड डायरेक्शन मध्ये जसं आपण बेक करत जातो खणत जाणार आहे सो दॅट द फर्स्ट प्रोसेस ऑफ द बर्ड्स वर ऑब्झर्व विच इज फॉलोड बाय मॅमल्स फॉलोड बाय रेप्टाईल्स विच इज फॉलोड बाय अँथ्रोपिया अँड विच इज फॉलोड बाय पायसेस अँड इनवर्टेबेस मीन्स टू द बॉटम दॅर इज द इनवर्टेबेट्स आर प्रेझेंट इंडिकेट्स दॅट ऑल इनवर्टेबेट्स आर प्रेझेंट टू द प्रेझेंट टू द बॉटम इंडिकेट्स दॅट दीज इट इज अ एन्शंट ग्रुप हा जो आहे हा एन्शंट आहे आणि त्याच्यानंतर इनवर्टेबेट्स त्याच्यामध्ये डेव्हलपमेंट टू फॉर्म पायसेस डेव्हलपमेंट टू फॉर्म अँथ्रिबियन्स डेव्हलपमेंट टू फॉर्म रेप्टाईन्स अँड सो ऑन इंडिकेट्स दॅट त्याच्यामध्ये इनवर्टेबेट्स पासून वर्टिबेट्स हे त्यांच्यामध्ये तयार झाले किंवा डेव्हलपमेंट
male gamete unites with the female gamete the uh, union takes place to form the it uh, takes place to form a zygote now the zygote tissue development hota hai and it forms a embryo ya jab aap so embryo we have already discussed we know uh, all of these things on the other hand aapka ha jo embryo hai that is for the development takes place in the embryo now this study डायग्राम सम सॉर्ट ऑफ सिमिलरिटीज इन इनिशियल स्टेजेस आर प्रेजेंट एंड दीज डिक्रीज ग्रेजुअली एज द टाइम पासेस जस टाइम पुनः सरकत तस तस मदला जो चेंज है तो चेंज वाढ़ जो सीमिलरिटीज कमी होता है अपने ड्यूरिंग द डेवलपमेंट हे चेंजेस अपने बढ़ा मिलता Evidences. Yes, again, evidences. But now, what can we say? What about it? Maybe morphological evidences. Say, because you have to apply embryo, embryonic evidences. Say, because you have, because you have paleontological evidences. Say, yes, sir. Why are we not able to say that the origin is the same? That is, the development of all of the living organism takes place from the same on one sister. Apply, sir. Then, sir, Purvaj ha ekas hota. He sagre jaise apne la evidence hai bhagaran. Now I'll discuss the Darwin's theory of natural selection. Now Charles Darwin, in his book that is the origin of species, he gave the theory of the survival of fittest. Survival, one who is fit, he can only survive. That is the theory of the Darwin. For example, now put up the rope. Let us see an example. Look at this. One rope is. Let us see the rope. That is a cordy na kahi rope azuna le liya sa. अपने एक्जाम्पल अशा पद्धति एक्सप्लेन करता है सभी रोप जपत का एक रोप मोट बाकी रोप ये हलूह डिस्ट्रॉय होता काट इज इट इज एक्जाम्पल ऑफ अ डार्वीन सरी इंडिकेट्स दैट द ऑर्गैनिजम रिप्रोडक्शन टेक्स प्लस प्रोनिफिकली का ये रिप्रोडक्शन अनेक शुष्क मोटा पद्धति रिप्रोडक्शन होता अनेक तुषी की रोप ये एक रोग मात्र मोट होता बाकी सगली का होता डिस्ट्रॉय होता वॉट इट इंडिकेट्स का होता अनेक रोप आता एक रोप का जीवंत रहता अनेक है पर तू तर इज इट इट स्टार्ट द कॉम्पिटिशन कॉम्पिटिशन स्टार्ट होते कशा सा कॉम्पिटिशन दैट इज कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर सनलाइट कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर वॉटर कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर न्यूट्रिशन हा सग कॉम्पिटिशन तैयार होते ये सो डॉमिनेटिंग है सो प्रबल है तो क्या करते ही कैन ओनली सर्वाइव सो स्ट्रगल करते स्ट्रगल फॉर एक्जिस्टन्स स्वतः जगने धड़पड़ करते तो स्वतः जीवन करो अशा पद्धति बाकी जे है, ते है ते 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 होता आपोप नामशेष होता मीन्स दर इज अ कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर ईच एंड एवरीथिंग कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर द नरिशमेंट टेक्स प्लस ऑन द अदर हैंड मुझे जो तेज प्रबल है तो जीवन कर One who is fit, he can only survive. Shows that in some cases, particularly in desert area, that is normally upon the hill, in desert area, what they carry, to thus to the apple of plant material, living organisms, whatever matter, panya sa carry, panya sa apple la, that is the big shaga matter. But here, in particularly in desert area, it shows a modification from winning. कैन सस्टेन अपन जिस एक्जाम्पल मनू शको कि जस अपन डेजर्ट एरिया वे, वेगवेग प्रकार के प्लांट्स अपने बढ़ा मिलते कि जस आप निवड़ूंग मन तो अलोवेरा जे अलो जे है मॉडिफाइड लीफ तिथ है कशा सा टू सस्टेन द लाइफ स्वतः जगा सर्वाइव कराए सो द मॉडिफिकेशन आर सो द सिलेक्शन सिलेक्शन कस है फिट He is selected. So fit ahe. He is only selected, and others are destroyed. He is so fit nahi. So destroyed. Who is another? Sustaining and selected. Then job reproduction. So sustains are there lah. 
आहे तो जिवंत राहिलेला आहे जो ज्याला नॅचरली सिलेक्ट झालेला आहे त्यांच्यामध्ये रिप्रोडक्शन होणार आहे अनेक त्याच्यामध्ये पुढच्या पिढ्या तयार होणार आहे सो नॅचरली द न्यू कॅरेक्टर्स आर सिलेक्टेड प्रत्येक वेळी पुढच्या जनरेशन किंवा काही जनरेशनच्या अंतरानं सम चेंजेस आर गोईंग ऑन दॅट इज इट फॉर्म्स इट फॉर्म्स अ न्यू स्पेसेस न्यू स्पेसेस तयार होतात परंतु ह्या न्यू स्पेसेस होण्यापूर्वी हजारो त्यापूर्वीच्या पिढ्या ह्या जावं लागतात हजारो वर्षांचा कालावधी जावा लागतो अँड सो दॅट इट फॉर्म्स न्यू कॅरेक्टर्स इट इज अ डार्मिंग स्पिरिट